Right now, the video you saw exclusively first on 10, showing the moments a man in a wheelchair was mauled by a pair of dogs in Florida City. Just absolutely horrible. The victim is still recovering in the hospital. Local 10's Leanne Motohone is live in Doral with all the details this morning. Leanne. Yeah, and that video really is hard to watch. We had to blur and sometimes not even show all of it because of the nature of what happened. The two dogs that mauled this man are now here at Miami-Dade Animal Services and their fate is now in question. It depends on whether folks here at Animal Services determine that these dogs are a danger to the public. And if they do do that, they will be euthanized. A wheelchair bound homeless man is recovering from severe injuries this morning after a brutal dog attack. Oh my. The victim unable to escape as the pit bulls bite and chew his arm. Neighbors yelling and honking their horns, trying to get the animals to stop. Everybody else Greg, gathered around like 20 or 30 people and they started throwing things and that didn't really work for a while and then it just kept going. It happened earlier this week in the area of Northwest 10th Street and 5th Avenue in Florida City. The victim was eventually freed from the jaws of those dogs and rushed to the hospital with extremely severe bite wounds. Chunks, man, you know, and they, his face was red. Pictures show one of the dogs with a bloody mouth and body. Police say both these dogs live nearby and belong to a man who is currently in jail. Neighbors say some people People in the area were helping to take care of them, but somehow they ran away. The dogs are now in the custody of Animal Services. A spokesperson says if it is determined that these dogs pose a public safety concern, the department would humanely euthanize the dogs. And if the Miami-Dade Animal Services Department does make that determination, the owner would then have the right to appeal. Reporting live in Doral, Leanne Morejon, Local 10 News.